Hello everyone, Suslik here. Are you having a trouble to find some 18th century naval combat game? How about creating one? Hello everyone, Susigemi here and welcome back to another Brick Bricks episode. With the brand new water physics, I instantly got motivation to upgrade all of my current ships, even build an extra one. So let's check out what's changed. And by the way, with the ships, I organized the event with our members of Discord. If you want to join to future events like this one, hop into the Discord. So here are the ships, HMS Victory. USS Constitution and brand new HMS Speedy. You already seen these two ships floating in previous video. After that, I made some additional changes. So what are the changes? I tried to make the ships realistic and multiplayer friendly as possible. If you didn't know, in Brick Ricks, when you spawn something 1400 parts, the server will collapse, player will lag, it will be unplayable. So you need to keep the part amount limited as possible. That's why ships are not very detailed. They are extremely simplified for multiplayer purpose. So here are the changes I made. Reduced brick amount. The bottom is really simplified. It extremely optimized all of the builds. A new mechanic with this game dynamic surface option that you can add to the any part of the ship you can see how fluid moves through this part rudder functions if you lose you'll no longer be able to turn and that is really cool guys so this brings extreme realism to the brick ricks navel how to move the ships by the way there is no wind physics in this game so unrealistically here, you need to add propellers to your ship so they can move or jet engine. And what I did, I put one propeller per mast. So what's going to happen? If you lose one mast, you lose the propeller as well automatically and ship will become slower. So this again brings some sailing realism to the game. If you lose all of the masts, you're stationary forever. Sails can go up and down. By the way, now you start engine like this. Uh, in every ship there is button. Here we go. This button will turn on the engine and bring down the sails. Creating this illusion that sails are actually pushing the ship forward. Extremely cool. And when you press this red button again, sail go up, ship stops. So I call it anchor mode. Realistic fire mode, 50 seconds. I decided to make it 50 seconds after watching videos and gathering information from the internet. Realistic reloading time, guys. This is a big plus. Now from arcade-ish, we're switching to full realism in the brick rigs. Here we go. Ship got annihilated. Let's do it again for the small one. Fire. Here we go. It even flipped. Another new feature. You see the lamps at the back of the ship. And also I added some lamps uh, while you're in first person. This lamps at the left and right, they're indicating the reloading status. So I'm emptying my left cannons now. Left broadside. Lamp turned off. You need to basically hold the fire button until this uh, lamp will turn back on. As soon as it's on, that means cannons are ready to fire. I'm gonna cut the video. You're taking like fi between 50 or 55 seconds. Oh, here we go. Turned on, that means cannons are ready to fire. Now, I obviously released the fire button. Now, if I want to sink a ship, and to hold the fire button again. Not just press, hold. I'm holding it. Here we go. Uh, fires the cannons separately, it's still here. So cannons will not fire at the same time. Uh, this adds more realism. Almost like a dream pirate game you ever wanted to play. Now you can do it in Brick Bricks. All right, what, what else I added? Powder barrel detonation. This is the feature that, that I added after finishing like uh, all of the ships. Now all of the ships have this 
powder barrels or kegs, whatever you want to call them. Obviously, bigger your ship, more kegs you have. So each ship have one keg at uh, one floor. So Victory have like one, two, three, four, four keg. So direct shot to the keg will cause an fire. I thought this will be like game breaking and bit unfair, but after realizing how good it looks in this game, I decided to keep this keg feature. So check this out. Imagine I'm shooting with the cannon, with the other ship's cannon, and that's a hit. Here we go. The ship will catch on fire and slowly burn. The captain will burn with it. And that's a really cool looking feature. It brings even more realism. Realism upon realism. And also I changed the helms of the ships. I made them more simplified. I just realized it looks like a helm from the volley. This is the helm of the HMS Victory. Helm of the Brick Detution. As you can see a double design here. HMS Spirit don't have helm uh, from the ship models I've seen. It had a stick that is connected to the rudder, just like I said in my stream. So really cool design here. How to start a ship, get it in the first person, looking down, pressing at the red button. And yeah, I played lots of ship games. Most popular ones, Sea of Thieves and Black Flag. In Sea of Thieves, I mean, it's probably the much closer one to the realism, but ships there are just uh, not ships. Uh, like, the biggest one there is Galleon, and it has only eight cannons. I don't call that a ship, but here in Brick Ricks, you can stick up historically accurate amount of cannons to your ships. And there's incoming one, Skull and Bones. It's basically the same thing, arcade -ish as hell. There's HP bars and stuff. But in Brick Ricks, every part can be destroyed. There is some realism going on. Uh, physics destruction. You don't see this in most of the ship games. Now we're gonna see some clips from our community event. This might take more than one video uh, because it was recorded on separate two days. Enjoy. All right, take off your clothes. Everyone. Oh God. Just drop them. Uh, everything's a bit early for that right now. I mean, we've only been talking. You're a pirate now. Black pants. Perfect. Who's this Im imposter, Sassy Baka? Wear black pants. I'm in the oopsie. I might have deleted the ship. Um. <laughs> Get back in. I I've deleted it. How are you <laughs> deleting it? Well, you see, I have this thing called pure skillage. Um. <laughs> okay. Get in. Get in my ship. It's the second from front. Okay. In three. Hold. Who's who's on my boat? What the? Hell? <laughs> This is going so well. <laughs> <laughs> He's boarding. Okay, who's on my ship? <laughs> I am. So you you need a new ship, right? Yes. Okay. <laughs> In three, two, one, go. First track. Go, go, go. Oh, <laughs> who was that? Oh, Come on, reload, reload. Left roadside. Fire! 
Oh god, oh god. Oh no, I, I turned a bit harshly. Somebody's run away, don't don't leave the battlefield. Uh, I can't, I have no steering wheel. Twisted and Apple is about to be broadsided. Somebody lost their sails. Three ships following each other right now. So that means three players left and one is deactivated. He lost his rudder. The front one stopped. Let's see what he's gonna do. A really sneaky tactic. Oh, one of the ships flipped. I don't know how. It's the one without rudder control. Okay. Uh, two ships alive, right? Currently. Think yes, so. I think so. Okay, guys, you need to kill each other. I have no rudder control. Neither do I. <laughs> I think we need to decide uh, in a gentleman way. One v one with the big ships. Are both oh, sides done. okay with that? I'm done with that. <laughs> okay, go. Keep. <clears throat> kill him, Captain. Please. Go on, Captain! Wait a minute. What? The ships are a bit close together. Oh, they're running. <laughs> oh, broadside, broadside! Traded some broadsides, still uh, in a good shape, both of the ships still alive. Should we board the ship? <laughs> board! Oh god, Captain. I guess it's a good sign we are winning or not. Oh no! Oh not. no! Ah! Yes, yes. <laughs> nice. 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 That was a good battle. <laughs> but, a, but a scratch. We're fine. Uh, yeah. Gentlemen, HMS victory up ahead. Let's finish her. Go, 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 go! Let's go! Set sail! Battle formation! Oh, oh no. <laughs> Guys, he's gonna kill us all with one salva! Spread! No, just run him! It's fine, it'll work, trust me! Broadside, everyone! Broadside! Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. It's reloading, 50 seconds. Attack, boys, attack, attack. Watch for the back cannons. All of our lamps are open. That means she's ready to fire. Watch out. Why am I not turning? Why did you tell me snitch? 
Your radar Wait. is gone, maybe. I've got a strategy. Whoever took her rudder, good job. We're never gonna know that hero. I see that her right lamp is on as well, so watch out. Oh, her left is ready as well, watch out. Oh no! Hey, whoever is in that ship over to my uh, port? <laughs> no! Ugh, I think I'm like dying, <laughs> I'm dying! Go, go to her back go. cannons. I can't move anymore. Oh no, I'm burning, I'm burning. Move up, move up, move up. Please, uh, don't tell me we lost the stationary HMS Victor. Okay, she's doing something. Frontal cannons wor working. Oh, it tried to ram. Right both sides. I thought well, your I back cannons were disabled because uh, your back is quite messed up. That's uh, victory for the victory. He's naked. Naked pirates. <laughs> okay. Yo, <laughs> Jay. Hop into the ship, mate. He's wearing the clothes again. <laughs> he took it serious. He doesn't have to access the settings. Stop! Don't ram the ship! Don't ram the ship! Stop! Everybody stop! Such a chaos. Red shot. Orange. Oi, oi, oi. We are gonna sink you. Here we go. Here we go. Okay, I think we're ready. Don't ram! Broadside, mate! Broadside! You're wasting your cannons. Rest in peace. Oh, shit. Oh god. Where's the broadside mate? What the hell? Why are my It was a humiliating defeat for the HMS victory. As it burns, rest of the team was watching it in a shock.